want you for a moment to imagine the scene of the Prophet ﷺ's death. When you had Abu Bakr, Umar, Uthman, Ali, and these type of people there, and the people were in such trauma that there was a Bedouin Arab who was running around back and forth in the masjid saying, Allahumma khudh basari, oh Allah, take away my eyesight because I don't want to lay my eyes on anyone after the Prophet ﷺ. And you know, subhanAllah, the death of the Prophet ﷺ being the greatest tragedy that this ummah has ever faced, was, it was so great that after the Prophet ﷺ passed away for hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of years, the way to console a person who had lost someone beloved to them was to say to that person, Uthkur musabaka fi mawti Rasulillahi sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. Remember the death of the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. Remember the tragedy, your disaster, your tragedy and the death of the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. But in essence, Al Imam al Dhahabi rahimahullah, he said something extremely powerful. He said, Wallahi, even though he passed away sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, he was still alive in the actions and in the character of the people. You could look at people and you could find the exact demonstration of the life of the Prophet ﷺ. They were trying to smile like him ﷺ. They were trying to act like him. They were trying to walk like him ﷺ. He was alive in the Ummah.